I got bumped from my flight. Maybe it's not so bad after all. As most travelers know, airlines commonly overbook flights because of the large and predictable number of no-shows, people who have reservations but don't show up for the flight. Overbooking helps airlines limit the number of empty seats on their flights. However, if flight is overbooked, some passengers with confirmed reservations have to get off the plane. Getting bumped isn't always a bad thing, however. There is a growing number of passengers who feel lucky if their flights is overbooked. Why? Because airlines have to provide bumped passengers with cash, free flights, hotels, and meals to compensate them for their inconvenience. In fact, airlines usually ask for volunteers to get off an overbooked flight in exchange for those perks, and many passengers say sure. And happily be plain. Some people even make a habit of choosing flights that are likely to be overbooked, just so they can volunteer. Oh, now I see that's incredible. I got bumped from my flight. Maybe it's not so bad after all. As most travelers know, airlines commonly overbook flights because of the large and predictable number of no-shows, people who have reservations but don't show up for the flight. Overbooking helps airlines limit the number of empty seats on their flights. However, if flight is overbooked, some passengers with confirmed reservations have to get off the plane. Getting bumped isn't always a bad thing, however. There is a growing number of passengers who feel lucky if their flights is overbooked. Why? Because airlines have to provide bumped passengers with cash, free flights, hotels, and meals to compensate them for their inconvenience. In fact, airlines usually ask for volunteers to get off an overbooked flight in exchange for those perks, and many passengers say sure. And happily be plain. Some people even make a habit of choosing flights that are likely to be overbooked, just so they can volunteer. Oh, now I see that's incredible.